Hello, Twitch stream. All right, chat. I know you're not biased at all, but let me know who you want to win. This is Brandon, flying solo, Ron left, as his wife lost. The most exciting part of any game, the rocks. Uh, I'm going to have to agree with you, Cosmic Jello. Triple jumps is dirty, and it makes me feel bad. So he sets up the bump chain, see which way the big flock is going to go.
So I am now joined with Mike. Mm -hmm. How did you do today? Uh, pretty bad. I ran a goofy bombs list with uh, eminazamine, but I went two and two with it, and I take that as a victory. Running yeah. fire spray. Love to see a fire spray in the mix, especially Eman. He is yeah. just chucking them all over the place. Yeah, that's uh, what I was running. I had the misfortune of playing Dion for the very first round. <laughs> so that put me uh, behind and working my way back up for the rest of the tournament. Um, it was fun, though. Okay. Yeah, that's what matters. I did get to play both of these guys, and these were the two guys who gave me my losses. So I feel a little better about my record now. <laughs> yeah, no, it's always it takes a little sting off to have to play against a guy that eventually wins everything. So, do you have a favorite in this race? <sighs> List wise, <laughs> I don't want to see Jump Masters do well, but. <laughs> But Robert's already won one with this list, and Dion is always the bridesmaid, never the bride. Yeah, and he claimed that he wasn't going to run Jump Masters anymore if he won a store champs with it. <laughs> so I would root for him just to see them go away. <laughs> Either way, he gets the buy. I think this is just for, uh, I don't know, what is this for? <laughs> they both get templates. They both get the Agent Callus token, which is... Probably the biggest, most useless token I've seen FFG yeah. make. Um, they get the little plaque. That's right, the plaque. That weirdly doesn't even say store championship on it. It just says, <laughs> it just says a TIE fighter. Star Wars X-Wing, and it has a picture of a TIE fighter. <laughs> just mass still, produce 800 of them. They can use them for whatever they want. <laughs> yeah, it's still a cool piece. It's just, it should probably stay, say store champs on it. Yeah, this Biggs list is extremely gross. Yeah, I've been seeing the um, the Paul Heaver one with, uh, with Jess with Jess instead, but uh, this one still made short work of me. I think having the TLT squeezed in there mm -hmm. and being able to bump one of your pilots up to PS12 with Rourke can work really well. And I was on the receiving end of that, so... It definitely has potential. It doesn't have as much staying power, so I'm curious how it'll fare against a bunch of plasma torps. Yeah, huh? I don't know. Who do you torp? Lauric, I guess? Hmm. Maybe just erase the uh, hawk from the equation as soon as you can. Taking away the TLT will help a lot the jump masters aren't dodging that at a good percentage um, but I don't know I, I always like just you know they want you to shoot bigs fine <laughs> <laughs> and he doesn't even really need Rar because Rex out PS's all these guys yeah Yeah, this is one where Rourke isn't making the difference, so we'll see if that ends up being, you know, his downfall, not being able to bump up above them because he's already above them, so he doesn't have a, a use for that ability. So would he have been better off with Jess? He's proceeding all the way up that side. It's similar to what I've seen Paul Heaver do. It's uh, easier to yeah. keep them in formation if you never bank. Right. <laughs> so. He might have misjudged the distance, though. If he takes a two turn now. Yeah, I think he he's might just going to continue to go yeah. straight. It's such a foreign concept to me, the way some of these guys play <coughs> really slowly. Um. You know, I'm a big fan of taking my ships and flying them towards my opponent. 
um, which has caught some of the people who aren't regulars here off guard. I play here every Sunday. Okay. All right, so Dion's just going to reset things. Get his left turns in. That's a three, right? Yeah. Interesting. Do all those ships have that? Uh, I don't yes. think so. Oh, they do? Well, not the Hawk. Biggs, I would imagine, is just two turning. Maybe even a one bank. Hmm. Or a two bank now that he's... I forget that he has vectored thrusters on the Hawk, so... Yeah, that almost fixed the formation. It should be enough to Ooh. keep Biggs where he needs to be. Oh. Okay. Did he land on it? Or is he in front of it? Nope. Oh, he's on it. He's safe. Okay. Uh, going over again next turn. Well, I guess he wasn't concerned because he did run R2-D2 on Biggs. Yeah. So even if he hits it, no big deal. Hmm. Another round of no shooting. We promise, guys, the action will start soon. Yeah, I don't like that turn in. He's got a bank with, with me, the Wookiee ship to not hit that rock. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's going to be a fair degree of separation. But can Dion capitalize on it? I mean, it'll be tough for him to position to really get any shots off in the next turn. Some turret shots, sure, but I don't see... Torpedoes going. And that's the real bite in the list. Yeah, I don't. The green one's not going to have a shot. I think the only possible torp shot he gets is from the far back one. Mm -hmm. But then, do you really put him out there just for one shot with the torp at this point? Mm. Only if you think that you can just wipe racks. <laughs> <laughs> but even then, it seems uh, risky. Yeah, because Rex is going to shoot you. Drop your torps down to three. Uh, Lauric is going to absorb one. So at most, he's taken two. <coughs> yeah, I think you just three bank with everything you have with Dion. Barrel roll out of arc mm -hmm. and live to uh, set up a better engagement. Probably ideal. Just still cruising right along. Well, it's probably the right move not to, like, chase him into the asteroids. Oh, yeah, definitely. Because it's hard to line up that two sloop with all that stuff in the way. But it makes me wonder when he's going to turn around. Yeah, the attack values on the uh, screen are not right. I don't know how to screw with that, so I'm just going to leave it alone. <laughs> I'm going to assume most of you out there know what the correct attack values are. 
Oh, <laughs> I see it now. Uh, I'm pretty sure they all have guidance chips on the uh, scouts. He was inputting all this, and he was kind of in a hurry because he made the top four, so you'll have to forgive any inaccuracies. I believe they also all have intelligent. Okay. I think. Interesting choice with Rex. Sloppy play. <laughs> yeah, Biggs does not care about that rock. He knows he has R2D2. <laughs> I wonder if he's related to Dash, just not caring about anything. Yeah, you ran Moran Dash, right? I did. I did horrible. <laughs> Dash could not evade to save his life with mm. Lone Wolf or anything. You know, I always have that same kind of luck. Any ship that has two greens will just fail for me. I don't know why. One green die? Roll evade over and over. Two green dice. Oh, flanks again. I missed 58 point dash. That was my favorite of all dashes. Oh. But Miranda's just such a points hog. <laughs> like, I have to cram all the bombs onto her. So you drop dash to like 52? 52, yeah. Yeah. Which is fine if you can slow play and build up the rays, mm -hmm. but most people are just going to just rush you and not let you get any rays off. And then you become very inefficient. From playing a lot of Dengar, and he's expensive, um, and not being able to afford to put engine upgrade on him, I feel like I could maybe play Dash without that at 54, but I don't know how I could get any lower than that. Yeah. All right, you're running out of board here if you're Dion. Probably need to take your shot now. Nah, he'll fly straight off the end so he can keep <laughs> running this list. <laughs> I think if you're Robert, you probably just slow play. At least one more round. You got to get, got to get your TLT into things, and he's not going to go forward with that. Rourke. Yeah, this seems like an important turn to see what Dion does before you go mm -hmm. rushing in. Because he could either turn left or he could turn around. And if you can avoid it, you don't want to be in front of them. If you can see Dion's fake tattoo of a TIE fighter on his arm. <laughs> <laughs> That's how the gangsters roll nowadays, with the fake ah. tattoos. <laughs> My buddy Kyle, who uh, we, we started the X-Wing thing here, we came in and played every Sunday for like six months with no one else coming in <laughs> until we built up a following. Um, and now it's a thing. We have store champs and stuff with podcasts and live streams. And yeah. Um, thanks to Gold Squadron, of course. Um, but he got the, uh, the Rebel sleeve. Oh, yeah? <laughs> it's pretty cool, but it's a big black stripe. So that must have hurt. So you know, some some people believe enough to get their real tattoos. <laughs> Yeah. 
See, now this looks pretty intimidating coming in here for Robert. Oh, for sure. Because he has to move forward somewhat, and that's going to put him in at least one tour bark, probably two. He yeah. can probably avoid the third, but... This next round for Rob is going to be pretty gross. Top right jump is going to do two turn. Target lock somebody. The two turn and not the one? Uh, well, it depends on how far he goes here. I think he's probably safe with the one turn. Got to keep that range. Saw a lot of Skurg, a lot of Captain uh, Nims today. Um, not in the final, though. No. The only new Wave 11 ship that made the final is uh, Lorik there. Yesterday, someone won with Miranda and uh, Nim. Hmm. My hat's off to him. With a bunch of crazy bombs. Cruise missiles, yeah. Oh, okay. Cruise so you just set up the, uh, the six dice cruise with Miranda. <laughs> right? Uh, one, three, four, five, maybe. I don't know. She sacked the shield and got another one. <laughs> oh, right. Okay, five. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. The crews are pretty good. Um, I don't think the Imperial Alpha Strikes that I've been seeing going around are very solid. They're so hit or miss. Because if you can't do a 5 forward, or a 4 forward, because that's all the dice you can get, it doesn't, uh, I don't know, it doesn't work out right. You end up unable to fire. Here we got some action. Two blanks. Did he not suppress with Rex? Or do you have to actually hit him? I don't think you have to hit him. Hmm, maybe he forgot. Um, we will activate yeah, he's in range of work, so he should be suppressed. Sets up his target lock for next turn. Biggs is, you know, you want him to shoot Biggs? All right. I'll shoot Biggs. Yep. No reason not to spend this. Who is he rolling with three dice? Mm. I don't know. Is the TLT in range? No, he didn't roll twice. At least not yet.
Hmm. A lot of shenanigans going on. Occasionally hard to follow. Especially when Dion spends his focus to change no dice. <laughs> So the TIE Fighter's got an asteroid. What do you yeah, do with him? Oh. <laughs> it's tough. Right. I mean, he can turn, um, he can avoid it. I'm gonna go ahead but that's nice. probably a bad move. Yeah, you're not going to suppress anyone that way. And when you have <laughs> three ships target locked, you really need to negate as much damage as you can. Mm-hmm. I think he just eats the rock. Just plow over it. Who cares? He really needs Lauric in range one of bigs, though. Ooh, if that two, if he two turns right with Lauric and clips that debris and doesn't get his reinforce action, that would spell trouble. Maybe you just straight with Lauric, turn Biggs left, turn the TIE Fighter left, and just go after that top right one. Probably best. Uh, the, the chat is asking if any damage was done, and we don't have a damage counter, so I'm going to go in the other room and... Okay. See what the status is. I'll be right back. I don't think anyone's done, but probably not. But they asked, and we will oblige. So, so far, uh, Biggs is missing one shield, but okay. he has R2-D2. Yeah. I won't even bother updating it. Hmm. The barrel roll. So I guess he's just really counting on everyone taking a left. He really wants those arcs. I've always wanted to say this on a, on a microphone. It's a bold move, Cotton. <laughs> Let's see if it pays off for him. This is such a good movie. <laughs> yeah, there's a rock, but who cares? You're a rock. Safe. He does have the range, so yeah, he's going to pummel that top. Ah, uh, wipe a wipe a jump off the board. Just do it. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Thank you. 
Mm. Is that range one of the big zoo? It's close. Who's shooting? Uh, Biggs. Well, if it's range one, spend it because you're not getting your torps off. Three shields off. Let's see, who is this? Regular? Yeah. Who's shooting there? Uh, Lowry? Yeah. Okay. See, did he take hull damage too? Mm. Yep. Yeah. All right, so four. Four left on that jump. TLT. Ooh. Nope, not that one. One more. Pretty sure he's got three left. <laughs> yeah, I think you're right. Um, but that means that Rex really can't. He could finish the job, but it's odds against. Roll there, too many dice. And then Looks like he's taking two or no. Can't see what that bottom one is. <sighs> Show us. Show us what you're spending. Oh, yeah, bump the ships, guys. <laughs> Final table. Good work. So sloppy. But they, they are fatigued. They've already played five games. Biggs is either at three hole or one shield. Ooh, that is gross. Full power torb. That looks like a blown up R2 D2. Keep Farewell, R2. <laughs> it was nice having you.
So what do you do here as the rebels? Ooh. Probably just one bank in that hawk. Yeah. That two turn. Safe. Two turn Lauric to the right. Hope you can catch that wounded jump master on arc. Yeah. Or maybe a one bank if that pushes the arc far enough. Bigs though. Seems I mean, like the only safe way to get a shot is a K, but yeah. Then you're like admitting that Biggs is going to die. Well, <laughs> Biggs is probably going to die anyway. It's this job. Really, if you're down, you just. One turn that one jump master on the top to the right to make sure you get the block. Yeah, yeah. One right and then a right barrel roll. And then if Bigs K turns, he's probably out of arc. And we're about to see. Uh, bunch of dials reveal because intelligent this checks I agree a one bank with Larrick probably your best bet Assuming you do trade bigs for that one wounded scout. You have Rex, Lauric, and Rorik. Uh, I don't like those odds, really. Yeah, once he gets down to, if he gets down to one jump master, then, you know, Lauric can tank a lot. Work can TLT it. Sure. Bank. But um, against two full health, it's going to be tough. All right, so he's just blocking Rorark with the wounded guy. That's smart. So from the placement of that green jump master, I'm guessing that Biggs dialed in the K turn and he tried to block that, or successfully block that. Yeah. Also, Laric Banks, I mean, he has to eat one shot from Laric, which isn't horrible, and then he can just sloop left behind him after that. It pretty much guarantees Laric never shoots that guy again. Well, he did include lightning reflexes just to turn around one time. But yes. You just do it again. But he's got what he needs. Alrighty. Um, it's good to see that card getting play. There's a ship that's appropriate for it now. When did that even come out? I don't even remember. Her X Fighter. <laughs> oh, was it? Yeah. <laughs> that pack. <laughs> so dreadful. The crack shot expansion. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but they're about to get good. Mm. 
I don't know. Everyone seems to want to load up Talonbane with like everything, but you're still just a two agility ship. That's true, but you know, so is Poe. Yeah, but Poe gets auto thrusters. Which yeah. I guess you could. Yeah. You can give him engine upgrade and auto thrusters if you want to. I just hope it doesn't uh, warp the design space too much. I hope they don't get scared of making new modifications because they made a ship that can take three modifications. First it was the Interceptor with two. Mm-hmm. Then Pure X3. Eventually we'll get a ship so bad that it needs four modifications. <laughs> So Rex completed his K. Lauric didn't get blocked. But Biggs is probably going right into that jump. Yep. Oof. Yep, that's pretty good. Because at this point, you don't even care about Biggs. He's not going to be able to turn around for like two or three rounds. Mm -hmm. Yeah, all he can do is chase the green jump. Um, I mean, can push a few damage through before he dies, maybe. Or he could die this turn. It was Lauric's action. Um, it's probably reinforce. It's almost always reinforce. Yeah. But I can't. The token's behind the ship. Shooting the green one? That's odd. I would think we'd go after the wounded one. So it looks like green took two. Oops. I'm going to call the top one green. They all look the same. Yeah. One of them's going green. No, I saw I saw the wrong ship. I wanted this one dead. Rex shot, it's one hit on the wounded guy. Take one. Ah, why didn't you shoot the wounded guy with Laura? Focus fire. Focus fire. Maybe he thinks he can finish it with Roar? Yeah, he bumped it with Roar. Oh, that one. Yeah. Dang. Alrighty, so we will go, go here first, range two on Biggs. Just go to the target lock. Goodbye, Biggs. So Godspeed to you. Right. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. He did his job, but was it enough? Hmm. It doesn't look like we'll it, at, but uh, we'll Rex. it's not over yet. Range one on Lauric, or no? Range two on. I don't know who the hell she is. Vague hand gestures are hard to read. Vague hand gestures are hard to read. Looks like a hit on Rex. Yeah, we 
Possibly a dead Rex? That is a dead Rex. Ooh. This is why you focus Firefox. <laughs> Get something off the board if you can. I think the wounded jump master just I don't know. I just ram roar so you don't get TLT. Mm hmm Cause he's just gonna turn right. Range one. And if you lose, if you use Lorik to finish him off, then you're not shooting the other ones. Eh. Still, probably better to get a ship off the board. But he'll be way out of position if he. Well, he doesn't actually have to turn. Those nice 180 arcs. Maybe he just takes the middle one, banks it right. With the three barrels away, uses the bottom jump master to block Lauric, and then sloops with the green one. Yeah. Also, this is—I mean, you're ahead, but this is where you start to like second guess yourself. Oh yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Raven Cat, but Rex is dead. I mean, I expect Dion to do something where he'll be able to roll to possibly block Lauric. Because he has Intel Agent. He might as well use it. I don't know. If I was him, I would ram Roark, sloop the green one behind Lauric, mm -hmm. uh, take the bottom one, do a bank far enough to block Lauric so he just stays put. Yeah, yeah, I agree. And then if, you know, after you look at Lauric's style, if that doesn't quite block, if he just went one forward or something, you can roll and block that too. And then once you've blocked and blocked Laric, you can just do one left turns all day. Mm -hmm. Stay still. If he wants to clear you to do anything, he's got to go max distance forward. And then he's got no arc on anything. And you just plink away at him. Is he really? <laughs> Ooh, is this on a rock? It looks like he missed the little mustache rock. Oh, yeah, he's good. Three bank, three bank. Or two bank works. Oh. Okay. I guess you could do a sloop there. Yep. I mean, it's a turret ship, sure. Then you can just two sloop next and torp them in the face. Mm -hmm. No, no, what are you doing? Why? Don't. Stay there. You've blocked. <laughs> I guess he wants to let him get away. I mean, you have, you have it in the bag. Just, like, finish it fast. I think that's what he's trying to do. He's trying to let him get away so he can torp him. I guess. I don't like it, but I guess. I mean, blocking him and then just turret shots would definitely be the safer way. But whatever works. Uh, now you're going to eat a TLT and die.
We just went over a rock. No damage, but. Oh, he did still block lower. Oh, you know, we can't read the dials. That's what it is. Dion was able to actually see what maneuver it was going to be, so he knew it would still block. This is how the jumps manage other lists, folks. Um, he's gonna only be able to TLT that green ship. I can get the wounded one. Oh, you can get the wounded one? Oh, the wounded one ran, that's right. Okay, so he finishes one off. That Good job, is, Robert. <laughs> hey, he got as many points as I did against Dion. I got half points on two. He's not quite there. On the other ships yet, I don't think. He's got this, Devin. Relax. <laughs> Rourke takes two. H2. Of course you spend it. Spend it. Use it. with the two damage cards? Yep. Okay. See, your husband's going to win a store champ. Now you can, like, tell him he can't go to any more. <laughs> How many has he been to? <laughs> a lot. <laughs> a lot. Six, maybe? Six or seven. I guess I should have gone on tour. I just uh, played the home store and that's it. All right, chat, since he's obviously going to win this. What's he fly for the next one? You decide. This is totally official. He has to go by this too. <laughs> Pick the most jankiest list you can think of. Make him fly a Star Viper. Hey, those might get good soon too. Oh, come on, get interesting. Make him fly Fell's Wrath or some other garbage interceptor. Who's the other guy? With like the the Ryad but not as good ability. <laughs> he can like he's only got the one, the three and the five K turn. With no EPT. He's just like dumpster barrel interceptor pilot. <laughs> yeah, I'm drawing a blank. That one that never sees play. I'm not sure. Make him fly Hobby and Jack Porkins. That's a good suggestion. Build around that other E-Wing pilot that's not Corin. <laughs> that's uh, Etanabot. Etanabot. That was, I, I tried to make him work for so long when I first started playing. Too expensive. 
I'm going to take all these Z95s and give them all crits. Oh, wait. They don't actually hit anything. No, give them new Han. That is so bad, that ability. <laughs> I don't know. Now, with Minefield Mapper, I feel like you could build around it. It's yeah, going to be maybe. a one-trick pony, but it could be effective. Give him new Han and new Chewie. <laughs> the worst duo in the history. Go ahead, name a worst duo. Oh, they're nominating Quad Hawks, too. I've gotten beaten on Vassal by Quad Hawks with TLTs. I don't even know who's rolling. Like, <laughs> this is over. Yeah, it's pretty much a matter of cleaning up. So, uh, 72, range, uh, two. Well, has what, two left? Spend it, spend it, spend it. Spend it. Always spend it. Don't know what that is. Doesn't matter. It's not two damage, so he lives. Find it. Hmm. That's a shame. Rourke lives to fight another day. I wanted him to have to sweat more this game. Like, I feel this was just a little too easy for him. I mean, I'm not sure what the, the health is on the remaining scouts. If he lost one before he shoots in this next turn, it might still be a game. But I don't know if that's even feasible. Yeah, I mean, to be absolutely safe with that bottom scout, you just ram Lauric. Mm -hmm. <laughs> just laugh as he has no shot yet again. Because the Hawk has one hit point. I think when you lose the Hawk, you just concede the game. Yeah, but, I mean. it. I guess it. Like, how much do you value your drive home time? Yeah, that's true. But <laughs> how much sleep do you want to get for work? But I feel like you should never concede a final. Right. You're yeah. supposed to play it out, even if you know you've lost. Make Dion earn every single second of this game. Yeah, you never know. He <laughs> might roll consecutive blanks for, like, three straight rounds of shooting. That would probably be the most salty I would ever see him, is if he loses yet another one. He's deep in thought about whether to one turn. <laughs> I bet he one turns to the left with the green one. Just on accident. <laughs> no, no. Jump masters are made <laughs> so that you don't do that. That's why those are green. Do, you do the left loop. You totally have enough room. Half an inch is totally enough. Uh, Intel, what 
He's just Intel agenting every dial on the board. It's an AOE effect for Intel agent. Do a barrel roll. Looks like that got him back out of range one, so Lauric is likely in the Torp if he still has one. I think he does. What? What? What is this? Bump Lauric. Now you have to turn right with the bottom one next turn? I don't get that. Now you're going to eat a Lowry. Yeah, that'll get in the 180 degree arc. Interesting that Lowry took the two turn, because that wouldn't have gone anywhere if he had just rammed with the jump. Link and focus. Don't spend it. Don't spend it. Good boy. All right, so Green is probably at four hit points. So we Most likely. She is, see a shield come off. Got his choice here. He's going for the green one. Or not. Oh, roll butter. One hit, one evade. Uh, three hits. That one's going through. Lose the shield. Why is he TLTing at the one that's still shield? <laughs> I'm so confused as to why these actions are happening. And with the death of Rourke, uh, seems, this seems unwinnable at this point for the Rebels. Lauric's still in shields, so he might kill one. Green has what, three hit points? I think so. Either three or four. I, I don't know if that second card popped up. Lauric, Lauric. I don't know how you say Wookiee names. I don't think we can say them with our vocal cords. <laughs> yeah, I, I did never thought that they would make something more unpronounceable than Karax, but they have, two of them.
Wahawarik. I just called the other guy Wolfaroo. Yeah, and I know there's extra letters in there, but I still say it that way. Uh, we need an alien name. Let's just cram a bunch of consonants in there. Making sure he gets that block. Keep Lauric without his actions. If he could reinforce freely, he might actually be dangerous. But that's not an option. I think he still has torps on that green one. So he forces Lauric to go right next turn. He one banks and blasts him with some torps. Has lightning reflexes ever been played? I don't think it has. I don't think so. So what's the fastest straight maneuver? I don't know. Mm, three, four. I've only played it once. Lauric down the hole. What do they have? Six? Six all? Yeah. So he's got four left. Yeah, I think it's now or never for lightning and peace lights. Yeah. Um. Like, you clearly need to kill at least one of these damage. Like, hands. turn left and lightning reflexes? Mm. Right? Because you turn left one? and then spin around? It's anything, right? You I think it's turn. anything. You think? So yeah. since the jumps move first, I think that's the only safe place to go. Yeah. Unless he just one right turns and goes nowhere with the jump. I don't think he's even playing around like I, I, I think he just forgot that he has it. Yeah, he's just going to keep him there. I don't know the large base turning. I don't think it moves. This is really going to start to overlap me. Okay, there it was. He did it. One straight and lightning reflexes. <laughs> nice. And there's the card down the table. <laughs> he still gets his action before he gets the stress. So it looks like he took focus.
Range two. Is he dead? Nope. One left. One left. Oh, some sort of crit. I guess it was a minor explosion because he rolled a die. Is he dead? Saves me a little bit. He rolled a die and he rolled a blank. Okay. What could he hit first? One, two, not double damage, so he's alive. Oh my god, Dion won one. Are you hyped? Chat, how excited are you? So what do you have as an option with one hit point on Lauric? <laughs> you hope that the one jump master bumps you, and then you turn in to bump him again and hope you kill the green one, and then you live for one more round, and then you die. That sounds about right. Yeah, it doesn't really, by itself, it doesn't have any way to deal with the white sloops. The jumps can just keep jousting past it. So Dion was right to leave it for last. To the chat, we, we don't know how many torps they have left. There might as well be all of them. I mean, yeah. <laughs> he's got one hit point on Lauric. That was the smart move from Dion. Now he can't bump into that one. Oh, let him kill him, Dion. Come on. Oh. He still maybe he can. Upset. Yeah, he can. Focus. But if he, yeah, if he takes the focus to kill him, focus. then he, he knows he's dead. <laughs> Or do you just reinforce, the reinforce the back? Helps? Yeah, reinforce the back. I guess you can survive. It is the closest point to both of them. On a shit roll, you can survive. And you have to flawlessly kill the other guy. It is reinforced. I still shot the wrong ship, so... Four dice with Wookiee commandos. Oh my god, he's gonna kill him. He's gonna be so salty. Get wrecked. Get wrecked hard. <laughs> <laughs> but this other shot will probably oh. do the job. He, right. We don't know, though. Oh, target. Spend the focus. Get the target on it. No, was that on there? Ah, oh, he's got it. He got it. That was a cool game. 
That would have been hilarious if you just blanked out on that shot. <laughs> he killed him afterwards. All right, Dion won. Here we go. Celebrate. Yeah, yeah, because he's the one that zoomed forward. So I was like, yeah. All right, chat. Are you excited that he won? <laughs> boop, 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 boop. That's all he gets. That's all you get, Dion. You've played enough of these. You get one air horn. <laughs>